What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's me again, Jet, and today we'll be creating foil or metallic lettering in Canva. It's quick and easy and you can probably do this in less than five minutes. So okay, first things first, you have to download or get hold of some metallic foil patterns or images. You can try searching Creative Fabrica, Creative Market, Design Cuts, or even Etsy. And uh, just make sure that you carefully understand and adhere to the license that comes with any stock image that you download and intend to use for commercial purposes. These different websites all have different licenses and restrictions and it's important to know that the image is suitable for what you intend to do with it. So again, read that license and make sure you understand what it means and stick to the rules and adhere to that license. And if you're new to my channel, welcome and be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I post one of these videos. Alright, let's get started. So now we are in Canva and in your uploads section, just upload the files or those images, the metallic foil images that you've recently downloaded. And I already have mine here. Next thing we need to do is go to elements and go to frames. Just click on this see all and we need to select those letters, this text letters. So for example, I have this, let's do this one. We need to use this letter text frames, not the other ones that uh, you normally use because this will automatically insert images on these frames. So let's position this horizontally. There you go. Now that we have it, just go to uploads and then click on the metallic foil that you want to use. For example, I want to use this one on this. Oops, sorry. that. There we go, and there you go. Unfortunately for Canva, you cannot change the font face. So it is what it is. Just to show you how you can use those metallic foil patterns, we can also do something like, like this. Change this, and then maybe that. There we go. It's kind of great for simple logos like this ones. So yeah, there you go. It's so easy and quick, and it's not even five minutes. 